Hey guys, welcome to Real World Tactical. Glad to have you here. My name is Tony Semana, and the class you're taking today is going to be Counter Ambush Vehicle Tactics Level 2. Introduce you to Diego De Vera, two time world kickboxing champion. We have Coach Bula. Coach Bula is also Argentinian, he's a professional fighter. Hey, what's going on? My name is Eric Navarro. I'm the president of Breakthrough Clean Technologies, and I'm here to get a little uh, Tony Semanat ass whooping. I'm Brandon. Uh, everyone calls me Sue. I'm a competitive shooter. Hey, Branch One here, IFBB Pro Bodybuilder in Miami, Florida. John Bartolo, taking Real World Tactical Level 2 um, Vehicle Boss. Hey, I'm Butch Steinley, uh, police officer in Louisville, Texas. I'm just here in, in Miami, Florida with my friend Branch and training with Tony. And just expect to learn a lot, man, and get my butt kicked. My name is Chris Goddard, I'm a security contractor, spend most of my time doing CPO EP work. Uh, I'm John Guerin, owner of Innovative Gunfire Solutions. So I'm John Dufresne, I'm a former U.S. Army Ranger and uh, expect to learn some stuff today. My name is Zach Deal, I'm a personal trainer in Miami Beach, Florida. I'm a recreational shooter, super stoked, I hope to learn a lot today. My name is Cheyenne Silva, eight years military police in the Army. Um, competition shooter for the past two years. Hi, my name is Isabel Montano. I'm the owner of Made in Apparel. So today what you're gonna be doing in my class, which you most likely haven't done in any other class, I'm gonna get your body and I'm gonna fuck it the fuck up. I'm gonna take it to its complete, utter end limit. And when you're pretty much ready to quit and ready to give up and say, I can't fucking do this anymore, you're still gonna go down range and you're still gonna put five fucking rounds on one fucking part. Doesn't matter what it is. Right? All I care about today is that you don't quit. You understand? You give me 100%. No matter what happens, you don't quit. I don't care if you're slower. I don't care if you're dragging ass. I don't care if you're crawling through where you gotta go to. But you don't fucking quit. So we're about two and a half hours in. Uh, he's already kicking my ass. I think we got about four hours to go. I'm already exhausted. We've ran about four or five drills now. Um, shot about, I wanna say about 185 come rounds. On, come on. Come on, Super tough. Tony is. This is not a joke. So if you want to do one of these classes, it's not something you can just come and bullshit around and do. It's, it's the real deal. When I pulled up, he said, welcome to the real deal. I didn't know what to expect. I've never seen any videos of his classes before, but this is the real deal. So we're about halfway through, taking a lunch break. Tony had mercy on us for a little bit, so 45 minute break. So yeah, man, uh, class is uh, just about what I expected. He's kicking our ass. So uh, he's getting payback on me. So that's an inside joke. So uh, yeah, it's, uh, I got a feeling the worst is yet to come. So uh, stay tuned. Oh man, yeah, absolutely. Tony's a phenomenal instructor. I'm enjoying the class. He keeps everything very real, tactical, practical. Uh, we're enjoying a little lunch right now, so we're gonna need it because I'm already wore out and so we haven't even begun yet. So I'm looking forward to, a, like I said, a butt kicking. We've done some drills, we've done some running, we've done some shooting. Awesome experience, having a blast, getting a little windy, getting a little sweaty, uh, burning some calories, getting that heart rate up. Uh, just an awesome experience so far, getting to work around the cars, getting some instruction from Tony, and having some of these great folks here pushing us and uh, taking it to the next level. The drill was really tough. It uh, definitely gets your heart rate up and uh, pushes you to be accurate as well. I feel like shit, but not bad. Like a little bit like shit. And we have to carry shit, like heavy shit, like people. So, can't wait for the next one. They come right back over.
fuck. Exhausted. That's how I feel. I mean, the first the first round we did um, before before this round was really hard. But I mean, if you've ever seen any of my videos, like you know, you know, I'm not a, I'm not a pussy. I mean, it's my clothing line. It says Savage on it. So it's I mean, I train hard, but I've never done anything in my life like this ever. So there, you don't have any type of mental preparation. You're not taking pre-workout. You're not taking, you know, you're getting your headphones on and doing the hype up music. You're not doing any of that. You're just going right into some intense shit, right into the drills. Then you're using the firearm. You're having to hit the target while controlling your breathing. This is the real deal, like I said last time. How are you feeling? Like shit? I just got my ass kicked. But today was a good class. Uh, a lot of work and a lot of hard work. And, uh, it, was, it was a good time. Uh, get your heart rate up real good, good workout. I like this kind of stuff, so it worked out great. Real tough, difficult, challenging. Um, nothing about it is easy. It's gonna push you to your limits. You're gonna be fatigued, and you're not gonna have anything left when you leave. Uh, it was a uh, excellent class. Tony put on a very good, very good course here. Uh, very hot all day. Very physically demanding. Definitely gas. Everybody was fatigued by the end of the day, but everybody pushed through and finished the course. There's a lot of courses I've been through, uh, not so physically demanding as this. So getting your heart rate up to the 175, 185 beats a minute and then trying to hit steel at 50 yards, 40 yards with a handgun, definitely demanding, but uh, everybody pushed through. So man, so I survived the uh, real world tactical level two training today, you know, combination rifle and pistol. So it was uh, every bit as hard as I thought it was gonna be. So uh, it was a payback times a couple. So uh, excellent class, man. You know, most importantly thing, I learned a lot, man. He really pushed us hard. Uh, you know, I've shot before in the stress, but not like this. I mean, this was taking it to a whole new, whole new level of intensity. Today, I shot the way I train in the gym. So, uh, you know, we combined the physical exercise, the fighting, the, you know, the, the running, getting our heart rates up, you know, 170, 175 beats a minute, and then we shoot shot. So, uh, learned a lot, a lot of good te technical things. Uh, got a lot of practice in. You know, we shot, we hit, we missed, we did it all. Most of all, we learned, and uh, it's a hell of a workout. So I definitely won't be hitting the gym today. So uh, right now, I've got a date with a big juicy steak and some potatoes. Awesome, bro. Great job, you guys, bro. You fucking give it 100%, man. I was a little bit surprised at uh, how fatigued I got, but um, you know, there, there's there's nothing that can parallel that that adrenaline, that heart rate, that fatigue, and trying to perform under that. Um, there's a huge tendency to just kind of rush yeah. through things, and, and an exercise like this, and a class like this, when you're doing drills, it gives you an opportunity to think through things slow down settle down you got good coaching in the background so it gives you an opportunity to work through some things and some different uh, scenarios and stress uh, stresses and um, I just thought I thought it was great what do you think about Tony <sighs> fuck Tony and fuck real world tactical <laughs> <laughs>